So apparently there's a pretty good reason why Jaden is MIA from his family and even refuses to do family interviews. And it has a lot to do with Will Smith's secret obsession. Well, not so secret anymore because I will be spilling a lot of tea. I know that you've heard a couple of times that Will Smith is on the DL. And as it turns out, whatever he and Jada Smith have been doing to young men in the name of mentorship is what has driven Jaden away. And people have had their suspicions for years with signs here and there like Will literally planning wet ones on Jaden. And guess what? His ex-wife, Sheree Fletcher, also revealed that other than Jaden, Will's other son, Trey, also got mouth kisses from his dad. Will is uh, pretty uh, affectionate. Yeah, he, he yeah, right on the mouth. <laughs> And you can imagine these boys hate it. And yeah, Jaden made it very clear that those kisses on the mouth were not okay. I think there's a time and place mm -hmm. for those type of things to happen. Right. You know, home, you home. talk about it, you right. want a hug, you can get a hug, you know what right. I'm saying? So the mouth kissing in public feels I like a problem. <laughs> definitely an issue. Now it's one thing to plant kisses on a son's mouth and even though some people may find it gross there are guys who don't see a problem with a man kissing their son on the mouth but kissing another man on the mouth I mean that's just something else and Will and Jada have been accused several times of doing exactly that. They're both bisexual they do weird things in their house and young men have left their house screaming to get away from them and their mentorship. Well, I know at least one person who left the house screaming to get away from the mentorship, and it happens to be Jaden's former close friend, August Alsina. Back in 2020, he claimed that he and Jada had an affair in 2016, saying that it was with Will's full knowledge and permission. I'm just here trying to fathom that Jaden possibly knew that his dad had given his mom permission to hook up with one of his friends in their own home. And you still expect someone who grew up in that house household to be okay? Oh hell no. And whether or not Will was also part of the relationship with August and Jada is still up for debate. And get this, in the Smiths house, mentorship is apparently synonymous with hooking up because it wasn't just August. Will allegedly hooked up with several young men who are literally Jaden's age. I'm saying that because of the artist that I just spoke to not that long ago that got invited to a party at their house. Everything was cool up front till they went to the back and it was a bunch of old fuck and young boys back there all ass naked. You know, I say this all the time. If one person says something about someone else, it may come across as malicious. But if more than one person is saying almost the exact same thing, I'm telling you, there's definitely something there. For instance, Trisha Paytas once called out Will for hooking up with one of her male dancers. How about worry about your cheating husband my male dancers, you know, when they didn't want to. Trisha was defending Shane Dawson against his cancellation, and she was calling out Jada, who criticized Shane for disrespecting Willow, saying she should look at her own husband's behavior instead and worry about that. And just a reminder that these male dancers she was talking about are closer to Jaden's age than to Will. Another person who said that Will definitely has a secret obsession is Alexis Arquette, who spilled that Will and Jada are both bi and that Will paid off his first wife after she walked in on him with another man. While exposing Will, she wrote in a Facebook post, when Jada comes out as gay and her beard husband admits his first marriage ended when she walked in on him, servicing his sugar daddy, Benny Medina, then I will listen to them. And Orlando Brown? Man, the dude went on a very crazy, very weird rant about Will Smith. Take a listen. The real Will Smith, what, what, what are you talking about? Where's your mind at, Just saying, keep your mind right, keep your grind tight, bro. You know what I'm saying? Don't you ever, don't you ever think that that's cool. That was the first setup, bro. You raped me, then, then turned me into a kid. Friendly reminder again, Orlando is closer to Jaden's age than Will. There was also a time when Tisha Campbell sort of suggested that Will Smith was having something going on with her ex-husband, Dwayne Martin. Not anything surprising though, cause Will and Dwayne have always given out some pretty weird vibes. Like why would they go on several vacations together that included trips to Sin City, Las Vegas, Miami, and even a private cruise in Trinidad, all while Tisha and Jada sat 
at home. Mm. Is that how bromance actually work? Or is there something fishy going on? Well, Tisha published an Instagram post with an image that read, the truth always comes out in the end, no matter how hard anyone tries to hide it. And according to followers, the post was probably about the relationship and she gave it away when she wrote the name Will in caps in the comments. And you're right, they will lie to the end. The real key key is people will stop believing them. All I'm saying is that it's these kinds of weird obsessions that have made Jaden possibly not want much to do with his family. And based on what people have been saying, it makes sense that Jaden would also do some unexpected things in return. For instance, one of the times Jaden proved that he was just done was in 2013 when he decided that he had had enough of his parents and asked for emancipation for his 15th birthday. But do you know what was even more shocking? Jada's response to her son saying that he wanted to be emancipated. And I remember thinking to myself, as devastated as I was, I was like, he's right. Yeah. The time is now. He's 15. It's time for him to leave the house. Maybe with Jaden out of the house, that would give them more space to continue with their weird obsessions. I don't know. But even his sister Willow has been acting out over the years. And maybe whatever she does is also just a reflection of what she's been exposed to by her parents growing up. Like how she was photographed in bed with shirtless Moises Arias when he was 20. And I won't even mention Willow's age at the time. But the controversy got so out of hand that child protection services were called on the Smith's house. At the time, sources close to the family told TMZ that Willow's parents believed she was mature enough to make her own decisions and that they saw the picture as an expression of art. And when questioned about the photo directly by TMZ, Jada said there was nothing wrong with it and the tabloids were projecting their trash onto it. Willow also revealed that she loved men and women equally and in 2021, she confirmed that she was polyamorous. With polyamory, I feel like the main foundation is the freedom to be able to create a relationship style that works for you and not just stepping into monogamy because that's what everyone around you says is the right thing to right. do. So right. I was like, how can I structure the way that I approach relationships with that in mind? Yeah. Yeah. Again, maybe she got too used to seeing her parents with different people and thought it was a norm. In another instance where Willow acted out was when she revealed in an episode of The Red Table Talk that she began cutting herself after the success of her single, Whip My Hair. And in a different episode, she said that she was not even a teen when she began watching adult content and get this Jada actually said that she knew about it but did nothing and you would think that because they possibly exposed their children to weird things Will and Jada would be more uptight with how they raised their kids well that also didn't happen in fact in an interview with E! News in 2013 Will Smith was asked when was the last time he punished Jaden and he simply said we don't do punishment then while speaking with Hot Living the same year Will said we respect our children the way we would respect any other person. Things like cleaning up their room, you would never tell a full grown adult to clean their room. So we don't tell our kids to clean their rooms. I don't know guys, something just seems really off. But you let me know what you think. Did Will's secret obsession push Jaden away? Do the Smiths actually go too far? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And if you thought this video was messy, wait till you check out the next one.